will see uh, how to read the XML data without using uh, joinal transformations. So without joining the <coughs> root sections and subsections. Let's go to the Informatica. So you can see already I have the mapping. I am reading the books, books XML files. And these XML files I have the uh, different sections. This is the root section and this is the category section and this is the book detail sections so you can see the joiner transformation i am using first i am joining these two sections with primary key of the this section and a foreign key of the this section and getting the country and the corresponding category here in this joiner and again in this another joiner uh, transformation i am getting um, you know category of the primary key the corresponding columns and the category of the foreign key and here corresponding columns and then i joined with uh, the condition pk of the book category key fk of the book category key and then i am loading to the target table to get the data from the XML. In this expression transformation, just I am removing the comma and dollar values from the amount columns. And I am loading to the target book list TGT to the Oracle table. Open the workflow. Let's check this table. This table have the data. It has 20 records. Let's structure this table. And you can see there is no data. Start the workflow. It succeeded. I can see 20 records are loaded. Total 20 records. Okay. Now we'll see how we'll be now create. Uh, let's say copy as I am copying this uh, this one source without joins. I copied this one as now. This is the accessory already. I don't want to uh, disturb now anything let this join a transformation remote okay now go to the source clear the space and import the same accessibility definition once again with a different name next hierarchy relationships are uh, you know, uh, rename this is already existing books dot join I mean without sorry uh, books that let's say new books that new so this XML okay so how we are uh, previous mapping I am getting the country from this section and the category from this section and the corresponding elements from this section so open this double click on this view and see just to create a new view here XML view and uh, you can see this is the book root now go to the book root root section and select the show xpath navigator and i'm getting the country from this section right so just drag and drop this country here and again book category i am getting category here category and again book details i am adding um, i want item code book name all of these columns so just to drag all these columns book name book name other and net premium now I remove these elements yes I mean sorry views all these views yes and validate XML definition is valid. Now save it. 
save it now go to the mapping and drag and drop the source books dot new it is added here books dot new now you can see only those uh, columns are available now drag country here category item code book name uh, net price amount here and other here save it now take this mapping and create your flow and create the task at s underscore m underscore this one number underscore xml without joins then uh, link the link task now you can open this one save it what is the previous one is there just add those ones only at the source is, uh, this one same path and indirect and you can see target is uh, mongo connection and truncate target enable the truncate target option and add the file name this is the file name control c they add it is same here okay save it so let's go to the first uh, oracle same target I am using now I have the data because I ran previous uh, one now truncate the data now you can see no data is there now just to start the flow now you can see the join is is a uh, succeeded successfully and you can see see that same 20 records are loaded without using join conditions join transformations because when you are using join transformation it will give the you know um, worst performance to join the you know uh, in informatica uh, it will create the catchy files so you can create the uh, view to eliminate the join transformations thank you